Hello Grace Church Sunday School! I'm Jarvis and I'm a unicorn. Dom has told me that you're learning about the Ten Commandments and that you're on the last one. You shall not covet. Coveting is wanting something that isn't yours, belongs to someone else. And to be honest, I really struggle with this. I've got a friend called Jeremy. He's got the softest, silkiest mane, and I wish my mane was like his. He can run really fast as well. And he's got loads of toys, and he's got a massive house, and if I'm honest, I'm jealous of Jeremy. But God says coveting is not good. This command proves that we get life wrong. But Jesus, he gets life right. Let me read a very famous description of Jesus from the Bible. It's found in Philippians chapter 2. Jesus, being in very nature God, did not consider equality with God something to be used to his own advantage. Rather, he made himself nothing by taking the very nature of a servant, being made in human likeness and being found in appearance as a man, he humbled himself by becoming obedient to death, even death on a cross. You see, Jesus lived in the opposite way. He was content, which means he was happy with what he had. Instead of always wanting more, 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 he was happy and thankful. And Jesus died on the cross so that we can be forgiven. <laughs> As I was saying, Jesus died on the cross so that we can be forgiven all the ways in which we are jealous and ungrateful. A big part of following Jesus is being thankful. Thankful that Jesus died on the cross and rose again to save us from our sin. Thankful for all the good things God gives us every day. Thankful for all that God has promised us. But I'm not going to be happy and thankful to God if I keep wanting Jeremy's stuff, am I? So I need help. I need God's help to change. But one day, Jesus will come back. And if we love Jesus, we will be made perfect. We won't be silly and sinful, wanting other people's stuff. We'll be happy. We'll be thankful. We'll be full of praise and thanks to God forever. <laughs>